Hey guys, Wayne with the Diesel Stop here. So uh, we got our parts coated here at uh, Polydyne now, and I'm going to let uh, Carl talk about his uh, coatings here that he put on these pistons. And uh, just as before, guys, this here is the uh, 1,000 horse Black Betty. This is for the 500 horse Gray Dodge, and these pistons on the back row are for the 5.9 uh, Common Rail that I'm going to build. Uh, here we got our pistons with our synthetic polymer ceramic polydyne HS gold on the top of the piston. Uh, this will help insulate the top of the piston, uh, keep them from burning the piston, and it'll also uh, help with the uh, flame propagation over the top of the piston. On the skirt of the piston is polydyne RP. It is a composite coating that has the ability to attract oil to the skirt of the piston, uh, keep from scuffing or galling a piston, uh, really helps out on the cylinder walls, uh, helps for a better ring seal. Um, this coating has, uh, we actually um, uh, developed it almost 30 years ago and it has been on hundreds of thousands of pistons and it's really really uh, a neat thing that the performance diesel market is starting to really uh, look into it. The uh, main bearing there has Polydyne DL it is a very, very thin film, high pressure dry film lubricant that um, has the ability to attract oil to itself. So to keep the hydrostatic layer of oil in place uh, during startups, during uh, the operation of the engine, particularly when you're uh, running a very high boost, uh, quite an insurance and durability factor for the bearings. Um, we've got uh, the main bearings coated and we have the uh, Clevite Mala uh, Performance H bearing, uh, a very high fatigue resistant bearing, and we also have some Clevite P bearings which will go in our street engine. Here are the uh, P bearings guys. You can tell the difference by just simply looking at the back. The, the P bearings have got that shiny aluminum look to them and the H bearing has a much darker appearance to it. Well guys, if you get the chance, uh, get on the phone here with uh, Polydyne if you have some parts that need to be coated. They do coat, uh, coat other parts other than uh, diesel engines. They, uh, they coat gas engines as well, main, rods and mains out of gas engines and uh, about a million other parts as well. As far as it goes, uh, motors are not the only things they coat down here guys, the uh, motor That's parts. That's right Wayne, we do coat a lot of diesel engine parts, whether they are for a street engine. Uh, we're starting to see a lot of over the road trucks, the big the big diesel engines, the Cats, the Cummins, the Max. Um, we also coat a lot of, of industrial components. Oil field components, is, a, is a, they go through the shop every day. We see a lot of weapons. Uh, we can put special coatings on the weapons to uh, keep them from corroding and help lubricate the weapon. Uh, tremendous uh, uh, preservative. We do it in a lot of different uh, materials. We also use the Cerakote system uh, for, uh, it's a very good weapons coating material. Um, we do biomedical, we, uh, we do gas turbines. We've coated a lot of gas turbines and it'll actually enhance the performance airflow through the compressor of the turbine. So when it comes to polydyne, uh, we, we just don't settle on one particular field of interest. We, uh, we're always uh, developing new materials uh, to help with a variety of applications and needs, whether it's industrial, whether it's automotive, whether it's the transportation industry, uh, oil patch industry. We, we, we have quite a very uh, wide spectrum of materials that's available. Thanks.